Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Friday, September 14th, 2018. The tarot card for today is the King of Swords. Oh boy, oh boy. You know, I gotta tell you, um, wow, I, I would love to speak about all the positive attributes of this king, and I will, but I'll be honest with you. When I see this here today, I can't help but think that it's kind of like someone who's throwing a temper tantrum, you know, you know, very critical of others. And I'm like, hey, it's not even a new moon or a full moon. The moon is in Scorpio, though, still, but it will actually be void most of the day before moving on into Sagittarius. But yeah, I'm just getting the sense that someone is... You know, throwing a hissy fit, taking something out on everybody else. It's like those, those harsh words, you know, like trying to deflect blame, perhaps not able to handle the intensity of the Scorpio energies right now. We have the moon, we have Jupiter, and we have Venus. And it just, you know, they tend to bring out extremes and they also tend to bring out the truth. And some people can't handle the truth. I just get this sense of you're going to know it as soon as you see it, as soon as you hear it. It's it's just like, wow, I can't believe so-and-so behaved that way. And you're probably thinking to yourself, hey, that is not cool. You know, just so it's not you. That's all I have to say. I have a feeling that it's more something that you witness, whether you you know, see it when you go somewhere, or it's at the job, or at home, or you see it on TV, whatever it's about, you're going to be sitting there shaking your head saying, what the, you know, is, is wrong here, okay, yeah, it just, like, definitely, it's just like someone, it's it just like a, I can't even put it into words, but you'll, you'll know it when you see it, because it's like somebody just loses it, however, you know, this guy's a good guy, too. He has a lot of positive qualities. And you can strive to use them today. All right? He's very organizational. He has, you know, really good mental clarity. You know, where he, he tends to leave the emotion out of it. Like yesterday, we were talking about emotions with all of this Scorpio, you know, energy around right now. And unlike the King of Cups, who can you know, balance his emotions in a time of crisis. The, uh, you know, King of Swords is more like, uh, I'll just totally detach from them completely, all right? Leave emotion out of the equation and just focus on thinking about what it is I need to do, how I need to make it happen, you know, take that sword, clear my path kind of thing, all right? So it's, it's a, there, there's intensity around this card today. And uh, as I said, uh, with all the Scorpio energy, which is intense, I don't know if that's bringing it up, but there's definitely something here. You're going to see it. You're going to know it. Maybe you're overcome where if you've been sitting lately, okay, because you got to remember Scorpio is extreme. Scorpio can go from zero to 60 in a heartbeat. All right. So you could be sitting around doing nothing and all of a sudden you're like, I'm going to go. That almost sounds a little Aries-like, but you know, Scorpio is extreme and you may suddenly make up your mind about what you're going to do like i said the mental clarity is there so let's just hope that no one witnesses too much of the pettiness of all of this whatever it is it just feels like bleh. you know the kind of thing where you want to put up a pukey face or an angry face you know and go seriously you know Nah, this isn't right. That kind of thing. So I want to thank you all very much for listening. I'll see you here again tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.